So before I get into this video properly, I just wanted to tell you guys the plan for the day So first I'm gonna be doing my makeup and kind of sorting out my hair But I don't have much time and then my mum and I are going to go into town And we're going to return my Pandora ring because my friend got it for me But it doesn't fit on my finger So we're going to have to get it up a size and then after that we're going to go for a bit of shopping to spend my Does that even make sense? I was like, we're just gonna go for a bit of shopping Basically, we're gonna go shopping and I have a load of vouchers left over from my birthday and I still haven't spent any of them So I might go for a little shopping trip with my mum after returning the Pandora ring or swapping it or whatever We're going to do and then hopefully by the end of this vlog I'll be able to do a try on haul so now I'm just gonna do my makeup and just sort out cover all these spots because of stress, because of GCSEs and while I'm doing my makeup, I think I'm going to do a little playlist thing is this really gross <laughs> i'm not drinking from this why can't i open this simple task can't do it i wish i wish i was here i wish i was with the human wet but I don't really have time to blow dry it so I guess I'm just gonna have to let it air dry in town I am going to be vlogging on my phone in town because I don't want to carry my camera around but I'll try and show you as much as possible even though it probably be really awkward because I've never like vlogged in town properly before Ooh. I'm also gonna be wearing my bum bag because it just keeps everything in and it's not too big so it's really practical see you on the other side So I'm back from town now. I literally got like no footage, but I'll show you what I got. I didn't get loads and loads and loads of stuff. So first of all, I went to the body shop because I got this like teen choice voucher where you could just spend it in loads of shops and body shop was one of them. So I got a bar of soap. You might think it's pretty weird buying a bar of soap when you could just get a shower gel, but I feel like these, these just last a lot longer than shower gels. I got the wild argan oil and I love the scent so much because I had a shower gel in this scent before oh it's just so good and this was £2.50 and then for like £9 something I got the tea tree pore, minima pore minimizer I think it's basically a primer and you just put it on before you do your makeup I've never had a primer before to be honest so I'm really excited to use it I got two clothing items and they were both from H&M so the first one is this kind of t-shirt dress with red and white stripes down the side i wouldn't normally go for this and my mum actually saw it and told me to try it on but when i tried it on i just really liked it so i bought it and this was 12 pounds 99 and this is the last thing i bought i didn't buy that many things but i bought like a jumpsuit it's going to be pretty hard to show on camera so again i'll just do a try and clip over the top this was a bit more expensive but i guess you could just imagine that it will be more expensive than the other one because this is a bit more fancy i mean it's not that expensive it was only 40 £14.99 and I got it in a size 4 as well. When I tried it on I really thought it didn't fit because um, the top bit was a bit loose but then I managed to tighten the straps and that just made it all better and I love it so much. I'm definitely going to wear it because um, I'm going on a holiday to Mallorca in the summer so I'm definitely going to be wearing it for like meals out and things like this because I feel like it can be formal but also you can just wear it on a summer's day. I really just love everything I bought. Also I forgot to say that I got my ring fitted and now it fits really well so thank you 
Mary and Elisa for getting me this for my birthday. I love it so much. Also guys, I got changed into my onesie because I was really, really cold. I don't really know why because it's meant to be hot right now. <laughs> literally so bored of work right now like I need to do so much history this half term because guess who hasn't done any history of vision but I just can't bring myself to do it I just can't bring myself to do it what time is it it's 5 47 I've basically gone through Germany for history basically one out of four of the history topics. I have a revision timetable and I'm behind. I don't know anyone that actually sticks to their re revision timetable, but they're like amazing if they do. Well done, like well done. It's a bit later now. I was doing some Elizabeth the first flashcards. It's just not going in my head. It's just, today's just not the day. So I think I might be going on to biology soon. It is so funny that I think I'm going to pass biology but I'm not. Honestly though I completely failed that test so when I'm talking about revising it in this clip it's literally making me want to cry. But first I'm it's like six past seven and I'm going to wait until half past seven when I can listen to Radio 1 and you're probably thinking Lottie why are you listening to Radio 1? Dodie's new song is premiering at half past one, mm, half past one, mm, half past seven. It's called Guiltless and there's already been like previews on her Instagram and things like that. I'll show you my live reaction on here even though it's probably gonna be pretty boring because I'm so tired. But yeah, I'm really, really excited because I love Dodie so much. So they're playing Human. I think they're just kind of um, playing a couple of Dodie songs before they play Guiltless. Don't ask me why, but when I was listening to this song for the first time, I felt like I was going to cry, and you can probably see it in my face. Also, I can't include my whole reaction, unfortunately, because otherwise I'll get copyrighted. <laughs> I love this so much. Okay, so my battery's flashing and I'm just gonna end the vlog here and then listen to the rest of Dodie on Radio 1. But that was a freaking masterpiece. You know the bit where they will sing different songs at the same time and it's like, I know it because of an R. For some reason, I forgot the word for round, but that's basically what I'm trying to say here. It was like a ukulele and I was like, yes, old Dodie's coming back. I mean, I love new Dodie, but I also love old Dodie and just, oh my gosh, the both of them together amazing i did this thing that i always do right i just listen to how it goes i listen to the rhythm of the song and i completely forget to listen to the lyrics so i'm gonna listen to it again and figure out the meaning like i'm literally gonna learn all the lyrics to that and just sing it for the rest of my life like you know when she did that thing on she posted previews on her instagram of her singing all the different tunes at the same time but i didn't think it would actually be in the song and then it was actually in the song oh my gosh i'm oh i need to listen to that again now so i hope you enjoyed this vlog it was kind of all over the place but that's just my videos isn't it so uh, go listen to Dodie's song it's amazing I hope it's on Spotify I don't know yet I hope you have an amazing week and I'll see you whenever I literally can't talk listen to Dodie subscribe to Dodie follow Dodie and I'll see you very soon with another video bye